Capture more, feel more. The next change held at 8 Acres Pahang, one and a half hours away from KL City, welcomed 30 enthusiastic youths to embark on their video workshop journey. The next change running from 16 till 19 of December 2011 is the second Young News Network workshop of the year. This visual communications camp is where the Young News Network explores further effective creative ways of telling stories through videos, audio slides and photo essays. After a day of briefing at the start, we're now here at 8 Acres Pahang with 30 young vibrant youths to capture some of the most interesting things this place has to offer. Now these young ones will have their hands on these three days in writing scripts, producing, editing, shooting, preparing and a few others. Now I shall leave them to tell you the story instead. You must be wondering what are they doing at this moment. They're actually having their production planning where they are supposed to assign different positions to each team member so that they can come up with a story. <laughs> The participants were given an opportunity to have their hands on testing the equipment. Of course, being busy is one thing, but we must learn to have some fun in between, and this is what I call fun. As the night grew darker, participants were given a task to find strips of paper around the camping grounds. Lanterns had to be placed in the locations where they find the strips. The little piece of paper contains what they will have to draw. Found this. No idea what it means. The drawing in turns are used as a moving visual story. A video editing session was done to equip them with the skills they will need once they are done with their assignments. The next change participants were up early on the second day, all prepared for the appointed assignments. The assignments given were Kelvin the part-time pilot, pit cooking, the beauty of eight acres, and the fruit trading post along the road. Since one of Benton's specialty lies in the amazingly delicious durians, the lucky 30 got the chance to have a durian feast. <laughs> Yes, assignments have been accomplished, but not quite completed yet because the final touch-up lies with the video editing. It's certainly been a long day, but tonight's dinner is done in a very special way. Pig cooking is 8 acre specialty and we have lamb, turkey and chicken for tonight's menu. It wasn't an easy task when it came to editing due to the limitation of equipment and the constant power cut from the malfunction of the generator. It was a challenge for them as they had to improvise to get the job done regardless of what happened. It's currently 12.45 and let's see how the day has served up for some of the youth. Come on. They're all sound asleep. They must be so tired. They've been doing video editing like for almost the whole day. Look at that. Can you hear them story? They're so sound asleep. Okay. I'm gonna go get my sleep too. Good night. Finally, the day has come for the videos to be shown and the youths got busy with their final touch-ups. Three days have gone by so quickly and these young ones are ready to have their videos in the limelight. I hope you had a wonderful journey with us as much as I had. It's time to say goodbye to the next change. The next change was sponsored by Nikon and organized by SwitchUp.tv.